What's good, boos? It's Sheen Boo, and you already know. So today we are going to be trying out the ColourPop Wild Child eyeshadow palette that launched recently. Let me zoom in so y'all can see. Get a load of this pigmentation, okay? This is giving me that high-end eyeshadow palette. These, This palette is very well made. It's like blends so easy and it's so smooth. And as you can see, I kind of went with a brown smoky eye because I haven't done one of those in so long. But this is a really, really, really good eyeshadow palette. Like, you was right, Asia. This was a really good recommendation. Because um, she told me she used hers and she had really liked it. Um, so much that she went and got another one for her sister. So, because her sister wanted one too, Amber. Shout out to Amber because I know Amber be watching too. Um, yes. I'm loving it. I just had to stop and tell y'all that. So let me go ahead and speed through the rest of the way of me doing my face.
you can see the face is looking absolutely beat I really love the way this came out like oh my god I think it's these brushes I tried to I just went to a random uh, makeup store in the mall and I got these brushes they are bon bum b-o-n b-o-m if I can find them on Amazon I will link them but these bon bombs are the bomb okay you can see that right so let's try I got the eyeshadow palette that's not what I'm doing Let's try this pressed powder blush. I'm a little nervous, y'all, because I'm more deep skin. And I'm really trying to see if this is trying to give me some blush situation. Let's see. See, as I suspected for my skin tone, can y'all see that? This is looking highlightish. Like, I might as well just go on and drag it to the highlight area. You can see a little of the peachy pink undertone, but it's not. See, nothing here, something there. Okay, we're gonna have to use this blush as a highlight. I'm actually not surprised. So I'm just going with what I've been using, which is my Morphe. Um, yeah. We're just gonna do that. And then we're going to go back over with the bronzer, but use it as a highlight. Usually when something says bronzer, it's always a highlight on my skin tone. <laughs> Literally every time. So I'm honestly not surprised. It just, they can't make it fit everybody's skin tone. But that's the thing about makeup. You don't have to use it for what it says. You can use it for what you want. Because it's actually very pigmented and pretty. See? That's much better as a highlight on me. If you're lighter than me or if you're much lighter than me, this will definitely be it. So I'm gonna go ahead and apply this and then put some setting spray on and we could go to our lippy. I'm gonna probably apply these off camera. These are the Beauty Creation 3D Fold Mink Lashes. I don't see a style number or whatever but if i can find it i'll pop it down below you so much for watching i really like this ColourPop wild child collection the lippy is so smooth and creamy i didn't put on any lip liner or anything and i really feel like the color that it is it will match anybody's skin tone and it's definitely dark skin friendly as you can see um i'm loving the eyeshadow the bronzer if you are the blush if you're looking for the blush to be a blush, I would say pass on it because it's more of a highlight, but it looks good as a very soft, glowy highlight. And I really do like that. So yeah, I already told y'all I love the eyeshadow. As you can see, it's very pigmented. This is my first time using these Beauty Creation lashes. They look really good. So I like these too. But that's it, y'all. ColourPop Wild Child Collection for the week. Great recommendation, Asia. Um, thanks so much for asking me to do a look on this eyeshadow palette. Um, I kept it all matte. I didn't even really use any of the glitters, but most of my looks, pretty much all of them are glitter. None of them are 100% matte like this. So if you want to see me do a matte I mean, use the palette again and use some of the glitters. Just let me know. And if anybody has any suggestions related to hair, makeup, or fashion, leave those in the comment section. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Keep up with Sheen Boo all the time. Don't forget about Instagram and Twitter too, at Sheena Sheen Boo.